It's new at five, Maricopa County's new treasurer says he has some disappointing news for public schools. The previous treasurer made a nearly $16 million mistake that will directly impact the amount of money that government agencies and school districts receive in the coming weeks. Team 12's Joe Dana explains the breakdown on all that money. The county's top money manager sounding an alarm on how the county has handled its finances. Recently elected Treasurer John M. Allen, a Republican, says when he took office late last year, he hired a new manager to analyze discrepancies in the county's $5 billion portfolio. They discovered errors that caused the treasurer's office over the last three years to distribute too much interest to the county and school districts. Now they have to make up the difference. It's not significant as far as the overall size of these budgets. But anytime a government agency makes uh, or entity makes a you know, $15 million mistake, that, that is a big deal to us. That $15 million breaks down like this. More than $5.5 million less for Maricopa County, $894,000 less for Phoenix Union High School District, $726,000 less for Mesa School District, and the list goes on. According to Allen, in the grand scheme of things, the subtracted interest payments are not money schools plan for and should not impact their annual budgets. Allen says they've changed procedures and improved software to make sure this doesn't happen again. Joe Dana, 12 News. All right, Joe, thanks.